Milan derby, one of the best known and best loved derby occasions in the world of football. Tested for more than a hundred years. I'm your commentator, John Champion, and summarising today is Jim Beglin. Thanks, John. Hello, everyone. I mean, what an atmosphere we've got in this stadium today. It's all very, very exciting. The opposition will certainly be testing, everything pointing towards a straightforward win, but there's no such thing as a certainty in football. Well, exhibition match sounds like an easy ozy game of football, and a picture-perfect occasion until the word pride gets a mention. And it's likely to have quite a big say between teams that could easily be sucked into an excuse for another feud. Why let an exhibition match get in the way of that? So. These two will be going at it very, very strongly. Away we go then. You're a man of extensive football knowledge, Jim. Any individual performances which are worthy of note? Easy choice, Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Nobody does self-belief better than him. In his mind, he's the best in the world and his willingness to express himself and experiment comes from a ready-made audacity. Yep, you're dead right. Alessio Romagnoli. Hernandez. Rebic. Ibrahimovic has got it, a shot, very nearly a goal. Well, I think the keeper knows all too well that there was no getting anywhere near that. That's a big escape. Hernandez, Alessio Romagnoli, forward it goes, some dangerous moments but he was there to intervene, he is picked out nicely, Good possession in this spell, but they're not making much progress at the moment. Plays the ball out wide. Well, those are the kind of mishaps that all players experience through their careers. Uh, a mistake when you least wanted it, and it's just very annoying for... Alessio Romagnoli. Inter still to register a shot on target. Playing it through.
Hernandez. Kier knocks it through. Well positioned to lead a breakaway. Could have been in had that final ball been just a little better by taking that route into a central position he made it easier for the defense a chance to counter-attack here Stefan de Vries. Vidal. Kolarov. Milan, happy to play it around. Look, if you're good at it and instructed to carry on doing it, then you find a way of making it work. And they are. Vidal. determined to make his way through Is there oh good challenge and he's got it back that looked a foul and the referee's given it that was always likely to be the outcome yellow card the players protesting but the referee merely waves them away be a goal kick plays it to his right Vidal Lukaku hit forward here's a shot the volley but he can't put that one away oh that was great improvisation he got himself in the perfect position to strike the shot and there's the end to the first 45 both sides were playing for this towards the end. They battled so well today. And it's half time. Inter ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to be maintained in the second half. Inter off to a huge ovation. Such a tight contest. Nothing at all separating them. So away we go then for the second half. Inter can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. Lukaku has got it back. Looking to exploit the space. Nicely done. Good ball. Possibility for a shot. Not afraid to get physical. Tries again. Booted away. It's 
it's a corner, good chance here. Fisted it away by the keeper. Lukaku. Well played, that got them out of trouble. Christian Eriksen. Well, what can you say about that? It's difficult to know whether to criticise or, or sympathise. <laughs> I'll favour the latter because we've all done it. You take your eye off the ball and everyone feels let down. Inter lacking any real penetration. Nil-nil still. Needs someone to inject some life into this game. Cuts out what was really a sloppy pass. Looking to exploit the space. Pushed away. The ball crossed the line. Who can latch onto that? It's played into space. It's got away. He, he shoots there. He carved out a pretty presentable chance. I thought he was magnificent then. He had no right to get anywhere near that. What a save. Get it clear. Inter not making much progress at the moment. Plays it back to the keeper. Nil nil. But still time for one of these sides to win it. He was well positioned, just what they needed. Plays it to the touchline. Oh, that's delightful. Milan have a free kick for that. Could so easily have gone into the book then, but the referee's taken a lenient view. That'll be a corner. They play it short. Shoots. And again, couldn't make it. They're just lacking a cutting edge. And while that's fairly obvious, the rest of their attacking play is actually quite good. I think the key for this game now is who can show that extra little bit of composure on the ball. You can't lose it like that. Stefan de Vries. Vidal. Stefan de Vries. Well, they've got one eye on the clock, but the balancing act is very fine at this stage. Go for it, and it could backfire. Sit back, and it may be at a price. Inter showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Rebic. Now there's a chance to counter. Forward it goes. He gets his shot away. A fine stop by the keeper. Oh, he's done ever so well there. That's a wonderful, wonderful save.
shoots here. Not a threat, that shot. How many interceptions have we seen now? Someone's... And surely he must score. And a shot here. Both sides fit and he tries again. He'll be pulled up for a foul. The referee just wants a word with him, I think. long by the keeper an important interception things were starting to look dangerous Alessio Romagnoli Hernandez knocks it through there you have it, the final whistle. Both defences have stood tall throughout this game, on the line themselves to be reached. But I imagine, fairly pleased with that. So, Jim, the match has been fairly entertaining. I think the first thing to say is that it was about the right decision.